your eyes, keep your eyes on your lane. Yeah. Because when you do that, you make mistakes. I'm telling you. Yeah. And you said you made three mistakes. Do you do do you want to speak about one of those or a couple of those? Or? Yeah, one of the mistakes I, you know, one of the mistakes I made was uh, I brought the the kid from the Nelk Boys on. Steve will do it. Steve will he do it. He talked about that. I brought Steve will do it on the show because, you know, I was hurt, right? I was hurt because we talked about built in built in black. We talked about, you know, uh uplifting each other. That's what we talked about. Right. All the time on our show. Right. Behind the scenes, cameras off. That's what we talked right, about. Right. And then you leave and you're doing it. And and I'm and, and I do business with everybody. Right. But that's not what it is over there. Right. You know, and the people that is over there, they, you know, and they, they, they with Trump. That's what I'm saying. They're, they're so, an extension so, of the pivot, too. So It's all one. Right. So when, when you see a Steve will do it, act like that, and then you already are in that situation where they've damn near tank, all, tried to tank what was the best show an athlete has ever put out, what would you say you did wrong in that? Was it the approach? Was it the conversation? Was it behind the scenes? I should have pulled his coattail. No, 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 no. I, I, I definitely feel like that conversation needed to be had. Like, yeah. you know that that that's the whole. That was the whole point of it. And let's like, address you playing let, with culture. Let let's let the audience know for those that may not know what happened. Okay, so man, this is months ago, long right. time ago. But basically, you have uh, what's the kid's name? Six nine Takashi six nine six Takashi six nine. Steve will do it. Right. Do this little skit where they bring in the uh, fake dirt, the fake dirt, yeah, the yeah. dirt look alike. Yeah, but Perkyo, like that's his name, Perkyo. Yeah, I man, I think everybody was looking at it like, man, it's a cool thing. Like, you know, he came out, he looked like Dirk. He ended up meeting Dirk. You know, his platform taking off. That's what only made it cool to me is that Dirk embraced him. Because if right. Dirk don't embrace you niggas like Drake sent the cease and desist to his guy. Right, right. Cut it out. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, because but, but Dirk embraced him. That's what made it more like, all right, we yeah, kind of we see we see the vision. He put him in a video and everything. That's right. That's yeah. right. So young kid, innocent. And then you bring in that type of like, do you understand what's happening? Yeah. And this with, is dead people. Let's be clear. We're playing with people who are not only gangsters. Right. King Vaughn was a gangster, bro. That's right. Not only that, you're dealing with someone that's now resting in peace, that's not here mm -hmm. anymore. You take and you grab a lookalike of someone, and in efforts to disrespect a man, you go grab the lookalike. That's right. And you put a jacket on them to say R.I.P. Right. Set up by people like and, Steve Wood. And, and this is the same dude. If you look at the interview, you got Trump pictures behind him. That's what I'm saying. So for me, it's like you don't play with culture because this is what all this new media and what your platform is about, my platform is about. Right. is like, man, we finally have our own platform where we can tell the story, our stories the way we want to tell our stories. Right. Right. We're at the forefront of this. Right. You know, we gatekeepers of the culture. Right. You know, you, you can't do that. But these are the people, like, we connected to. You understand? So, like, it was a mistake because um, that, that was not my lane. You well, know, but, you, but I could have took care of that. You I, sh I should have been the person that had that conversation. But, again, that's again. But there were some you things. You being loyal to your audience. Correct. It, it was some things behind the scenes where it, it just, it was like, it was just too disruptive. People were like, what? What you doing? Yeah. Like, why? Yeah. You know, like just stay your lane. Like you, I, I know you, my lane. You view so you view the way, right? Despite these little boy talk. Yeah. We talking business. I've been in yeah. those calls with 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 WME with you. Yeah. I've been on a call with with Go Puff with you, right? So I know how you viewed in that realm. What's going on? It's your boy Big Loon. Right now, if you looked at this clip and you enjoyed it, hit subscribe. Watch the next video. We on the road to 100K subscribers on YouTube. If you're a fan, come to Patreon. We got exclusive videos there. And also the show with just me alone. Salute to the supporters. Verify your customers and know who's your viewers. It's Up There Podcast. Let's get it. Yo, what up? This Big Loon. This is It's Up There Podcast.